Welcome. In front of me is a Lenovo Tab E10, and today I will show you how you can enable and also set up your portable hotspot. So to get started, you will want to pull down your notifications by swiping down from the top of your screen. Then when you swipe down again, it will reveal a bunch of toggles. Now we're looking for hotspot toggle, which might not be added by default. So in this case, we're gonna press right over here on this kind of like a pencil icon. And this will reveal a bunch of other toggles that we have access to uh, that aren't added by default. So right here you have hotspot. You wanna grab it, it will lift up a little bit and then you can drag it over the top, drop it. And when you go back, you should have access to it. Now, before we tap on it to toggle it on, I recommend holding it. And this will quickly take you to the settings. Now, the reason for going into the settings is because when we go to set up a hotspot right here, you can see we have a password. Now, click on it. We can show the password. And as you can see, this is just some randomly generated password. Without navigating here, you have no way of knowing what it is. Now, what I actually recommend doing is just selecting it and completely getting rid of it and then setting up your own password, which will need to have at least eight characters in length. Now, that can be letters and numbers. I'm just going to be using only numbers. Um, from here, you can select save. And that's really the only thing that I recommend changing here. So you can close this, find the toggle once again, and this time around, simply tap on it. And as you can see, it enables itself. So now you can connect to your hotspot. Now, one thing to keep in mind is your hotspot will be most likely using Wi-Fi. Uh, so, yep, there we go. We can see it's now connecting to Wi-Fi. And if I enable hotspot, it will automatically turn it off because it's using the same antennas to broadcast the mobile data as hotspot. So instead, it can only do one of those at a time. And just to demonstrate it, I'm going to enable it again, and you can see that it turns off your Wi-Fi automatically. So there we go. Now, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.